ladies and gents, welcome back, this is Marcian, I'm Such Paradox, and today we're gonna be doing something different, something new. Now not technically that new, because I have a small confession to make. I have already played the first chapter quote unquote of this game, but I'm stupid and I didn't have my mic put in or plugged in, so it didn't record any audio. Anyways, so today we'll be playing a game called Overkill. Which is basically like a very Doom-esque uh, shooter, like Quake, um, Unreal Tournament, Doom, Doom Eternal, that kind of game. Shooty FPS game, pretty much. That's all you guys need to know. It's really freaking cool, dude. Like, extremely, extremely cool. So I'm glad I picked it up on Steam. Because by god, it's fucking fantastic. You guys, you guys will see in a in a bit. But yes, I have played and recorded the first chapter of this game, Act One. I think it's called the period Basically, uh, let me get the intro first. So, machine ID V1, location approaching hell, current objective find a weapon. Mankind is dead, blood is fuel, hell is full. So yeah, I did play the first chapter, but I forgot to have my mic plugged in, which means it didn't record shit. Which is very unfortunate, but uh, but yeah, maybe I should turn this down a tiny bit more. This game do be kind of loud. Yeah, that seems much better. So you can slide. Well, at least that means I can skip this part a bit easier. So basically, you can slide endlessly. You can dash in the air. Yada yada yada. You can triple jump, but only next to walls. So there's no actual double jumping. There's a Shockwave, like ground smash, whatever. And then that's pretty much the gist of it. To some degree. Now after that point, you gotta go kill people. And if you lose health, the only way to get it back is to damage enemies near you. And then the blood that splatters out from them is that what heals you, pretty much. So New Blood Interactive, a game by RC Hakita. I forgot what the guy's last name is. Music stops. Ultra kill. And yeah, so that's the gist of the game. It's very really doom ass. Go shoot a lot of things. Shoot shit. Punch shit. Bam. There's like a, a, a meter that goes up. The more stuff you kill. And the more stylistic ways you kill them. And you can see my aim is absolute horse shit. You can destroy the little glass things with a charge shot, which you can do by holding right click. And it does big bada bada boom. It's very gory, it's very brutal, and it's fucking sick. So yeah, so... It should be a fun game. I mean, from what I've played in the first chapter, it was absolutely phenomenal, honestly. have not... like, I'm not that much of an FPS guy, but this game kinda... That was a sick kill. How about you guys take a detour to the void as well? Yeah, and if you keep killing stuff more fabulously, I guess you can say, and you get a bigger uh, thing about you get the top, a bigger combo. It's like sort of a, I think Devil May Cry had a sort of combo meter or whatnot, I think. So yeah. So yeah, I should be able to breeze through these early stages. Because I don't know what most of the things that happen here are. Which I guess to some degree is a shame, because some 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 little moments were extremely cool in the first place. And I'm kind of glad that I didn't get to keep those, because the audio was missing, because I'm retarded. Yeah, you can parry these things if you hit them at the right time, face off. You can parry it like so, boom, which makes them go kabooski. Which is pretty sick. But yeah, that's pretty much the gist of the game. Go around, kill the shit. And that's pretty much it. I mean, what else you need for a not nice nice parry dude? There you go. I mean, I was never really good with parries, honestly man. I always sucked with them in, in Dark Souls as well. I've never managed to parry properly or learn how to parry properly in Dark Souls either. I just kinda gave up on it, honestly, because there's just no point. Yoink, you can do like a blind slam. Or a ground. Come on. I know you can stomp on these dick. Okay, whatever. Just get stomped. 
Boom. I love the little sound effect that they make when they fall down. So there's a there is an orb here. You gotta collect these things for bonus points. And there's people that spawn behind you here. They actually jump scared out of even shit out of you, by the way. So yeah, it's not expecting these dickheads to show up. But yeah, I haven't gone past the first chapter because basically once we did the, the preload boss. Oh no, we're fucked. No, we're not. Oh my god. Once I did the preload boss, we stopped there and I went and looked at the recording. And there was no audio for me. Oh, rather, there was, but it was just extremely quiet because the mic wasn't plugged in. Uh, oh, you can like do little. How did I do that? Oh, I don't know how I did that, but that was kind of neat. But yeah. So, the coolest thing is coming up real soon. There's alternate versions of the guns you can get. You can buy them at points. This thing, the marksman, you throw out a coin, and if you shoot at the coin, the bullet flickers off of it, and then it goes kabooski. Nice. Come on. Hit me. I dare ya. Bam. Yeah, it works something like this. It's very cool. Boom. So yeah, it's it's a very it's kind of hard to kind of hard to use. You need to aim at the coin and not at the thing itself, which is kind of weird at first. Throw that! Come on, piss off, dude. But it's it's very neat. You can do some sick shit with it. So yeah, let me just quickly dash through all this. Cause I pretty much know what happens here. To some degree, there's probably secrets I still haven't figured out yet. I mean, the first chapter. I know there's a secret up here, we're gonna do that in a minute. Second, there's like a secret level that you can unlock from there or something. It's it's weird. I do love the fact that there's like all the up <laughs> these alternate ways you can go and do things. That's the wrong weapon type, stupid. Don't get crushed. Cool sword guy pops up. And if you basically go back to the way you came, there's a pedal still thing here, right? You gotta go back to here. And yeah, I'm sorry this kind of ruins the mood because I found this accident and then it's probably the coolest thing so far I found in this game. This little secret level. You gotta go up here and you learn about these things later. You can pick these up. It's like a little school. I think I named him Timmy <laughs> last time or some nonsense like that. But if you go and take him to the, the Z pedestal here, then that unlocks a secret level. Yoink! SCB. Alright. So, bonus level. This is not gonna say a thing. Just let it sink in. It's a fucking horror game, man. Something wicked this way comes. Oh, sure it does. Sure. I think it does. Uh, probably behind me, wasn't it? <laughs> Come on. This didn't take me too many times to do originally. Hopefully, it won't take many times here either. If I remember where the hell I was supposed to go, that would be great. <gasps> oh my fucking god. <laughs> I kinda hate this, I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, stop. Oh, stop it. Right. Slow and steady wins the race. Basically a fucking... Stick man. You probably guys saw it in the corner of your eyes on the left hand side. Come on man. It ain't that difficult, dude. Oh, good thing that doesn't attract him or it. Yeah, something wicked this way comes. I think he comes directly from the front. Alright. 
Okay, we just shot him there. That little. If you shoot him, he relocates like an Enderman. Did I just make a circle? I did. Great. The fact that you, you don't have that much vision to go off of is kind of annoying. Oh god. So I think this is the exit. If I'm not mistaken. Yeah, nope. Give me that back. Hello? Hello? Are thou here? Okay, I shot him. He's gone. Okay, I got him again. I'm pogged. Oh god, the fucking statue scared the shit out of me, man. Come on. So we're looking for a door. Here it is. Alright, so this unlocks this. Need the red one. Red means scary. Yeah, that's the boy. Now we gotta bring this back to the main door we saw, like around here. Here ish. Oh, best off, dude. I'm leaving. Bye bye. Skirt. Skirt. Alright, let me in. Let me in. Let me in as quickly as humanly possible. Thank you. And then you get some more. Testament 1. Mankind is a failure. Free will is a flaw. Let the evil of their own lips consume them. Then I shall begin again with my word as law. And I'm leaving. Goodbye. Something wicked. That was a secret mission. Pretty fun. Alright, back we go. Coin gun. Pew the third double down. So yeah, something cool about the coin gun is basically it, uh, if it flicks off of it, it will target a weak point of an enemy. But if it's like, if these guys are charging the thing up, Come on, I'm pretty sure you can either sh I'll shoot that thing in their hand as well, and that will also blow up. Plus, um, if you time it well... Nice one. So much for... For timing. If you time it properly, then it will split. I haven't really figured out how that works, honestly. That's also something you should be able to do. So this is where you need to go be going. This is a boss fight here. Is this boy we saw earlier? So I'm gonna And he's gonna kick my ass with it. Oh I don't have this shotgun yet, I'm done. We do have this. Boom. Also I'm pretty sure I'm gonna actually wanna test this out, give me a second. Oh my god, you can! That actually works. Holy shit, that's amazing. So maybe you can shoot other things at it as well. So like other things that have a hit scan projectile. Ooh, he's gonna kill me. No, he's not. I'm correct. That was a bad shot. Oh, give me the shotgun, boy. All right. So another thing that I uh, realized with the shotgun: if you time that correctly. You can hit the fucking pellets and it blows up. It's the fucking sickest thing in this entire game. Off to the coin gun. Coin, coin gun is just better. Coin gun is just, in, in, just insane, honestly. Nope, that's not. Give me the fucking shotgun, dude. There you go. Alright, shotgun. Let's get a little sick of these. Bonk. But yeah, shotgun's pretty sick too, but doesn't beat coin gun. Boom. Yeah, sometimes I don't know how the splitting works, I don't get that quite yet. It's probably like a specific time frame you have to do it at, but I haven't quite figured that one out yet. Oh, look at this fucking massacre, man, I love it. It's so good. Skirt!
Don't jump into the thing, that would be great. Into the fan. Boom. Come on. Hit me. Boom. So yeah, so far. Oh god. Trap timer is the first time where everything after that point is completely unknown to me. So I'm just gonna try and rush through this. Yeah, there was an explosion that happens if you shoot someone who's charging up an attack. It's weird. I don't know when you have to time that properly. No way I almost dodged into that. That would have been horrible. Take one of these. Come on, dude. Piss off. I just dodged into that like a moron. That was sick. Thank you for that. Dude, piss off. Now that was a bit close for my taste. <laughs> oh, I just sucked massive balls by the way. Okay, I might be focusing a bit too hard. Just maybe. Yeah, plus you can flick the coins off of each other, which is just the coolest fucking thing ever. Oh yeah, I forgot we can do this. Look at how much damage it does, dude. It's insane. Coin. What? Right, I'm gonna finish him off with a coin, obviously. That didn't finish him off. Right, we'll wait for the coin, dude. We got time. Oh. <laughs> Get dunked on, dude. Alright. I mean, I guess you can climb a boss, sort of. Maybe. BSB. Yeah, that was kind of bad. Anyway. Let's get the shotgun on again. Yoink. This thing is also fun. If you hold it, then... It will like do an explosion, we can only do it three times. If the fourth one will will cause an, an explosion, which we don't really want to happen. Okay, that's not what I wanted, but I'll take it. Ugh, look at this fucking college, man, it's beautiful. Whoop! Okay. Hey buddy. Nice try dingus. What is a shiny thing up? I didn't see that last time. God, it's so annoying that I always seen all this because this game is definitely something that I'd like to like if we have the option to re-experience even just the first part of just getting the coin gun and getting all that nonsense. It's just so fucking sick man. Could you not by the way? Could you not? Could you not? <laughs> hmm. Hmm. Nice. Nice. Oh my god, we got knocked the hell away, holy shit. Skirt! Skirt! Definitely not focusing way too much on this. Nah. Alright, we got the stone head boys. Are you both doing it? That's just not fun. Just die, man. <laughs> I fucking slammed his head. <laughs> so, red secrets give you extra HP, an extra 100 that you cannot uh, re-heal, basically.
Come on, get a get an over kill. Or get a There's a lot of them here. Boom. There you go. Ultra kill. Roll credits. Name of the game. We did it, boys. There. Let's get the blue orb, boy. Boy. Oh, good thing you can jump to that. It's sure that we're gonna get stuck on that. Right. That's a refund mission. Alright. Let's see. I haven't figured out how I'm going to do this yet. It might be more of a montage kind of thing. It's definitely not something that you can commentate to. Prelude Climax Cerberus. Oh, dude, look at this. It's a nacho cheese factory. I've already made that joke last time. It was a terrible joke back then as well. But I digress. Done? Yay! Alright, boss fight, let's go. Abandon hope, all ye who enter here. Hello. You're not a dog. You're supposed to be dog here. Okay, how does that um, AS, ASMR, ASDF movie one goes? It's like, hey dude, check out my new dog. Oh, cool dog. oh there's no dog there. And they just start fucking shouting at each other for no reason. Yeah, that's me right now. There's no dog here. Oops, today. I think you can parry those. Not him. Do it. Do it. Do, come on. I mean, I don't think I've parried it, honestly. I have no clue, by the way. I don't think I've parried that. Okay, coins do not work in here. Because of very enclosed space. You just gotta stick it to the shotgun and then just hope for the best. God, already, I'm really fucking hoping that by the end of the game, we either get a double, double jump ability, because that would be fucking sick, or like a, a grappling hook of some sort, so you can either pull yourself towards someone, or pull them towards you. That would be fucking cool, because having to... Oh god, that was a nice sync attack, dude, it's nice. Because having to just juke around left and right, you should probably use a different weapon. Oh, yeah, fuck. Oh god, you're angry now. I'm sorry, kitty brother. Nothing personal, boy. What? Um. Okay, we should probably get down from there before you end my my face. Get wrecked. Huh. Right, abandon hope all ye who enters here. Skirt! Skirt demon. Skirt, skirt. I'm the skirt man. Skibidi bidi bidi bop. Bada poop. There. ESB. And that's pretty much chapter one. So, to end it there, before we go on, there was one other function never really checked out what this is. So, the cyber gun is like an endless survival mode. Never looked at this on the original episode, so let's have a look at this, what this is all about. Enter the cyber grind. Yep. Uh. Waves, patterns, teams. Let's make it dark, I guess. Dark mode gang, rise up. Oh, dude, that looks sick. Oh, it's like a fucking matrix simulation. That's neat. Oh, this is fucking great to like hone your skills and shit. Oh, you still get points. That too. Coin. Coin for the. Dude, you hearing that music by the way? And that is gonna get your blood pump in. Dude. Makes me go around and fucking kill shit. It's like a sick, like. I don't know, is it like DMB? Sort of metal drum step maybe? Dude, can I just not get the. Fucking explosive shot off. What are these guys? Okay, they blow up, they're like a self destruct robot, sick. Not a fan. 
and go through that four at the same time. Do I? I'm probably seeing some enemies that we're not supposed to see just yet. If I have to make a while, I guess. Nice, missed every single coin. Great. Missed all the coins again. You know what? Fuck you, in particular. Uh, one enemy. Wait, oh, hello. Goodbye. Oh, I don't know who just blew up, but they're dead now. Whatever that was. He's dead now. Dude, this is sick, by the way. Nice. I missed all every single point. Oh god, they've got fucking flame towers, dude. What the hell? Well, I don't need a flame tower. I got these, and I got coins. More coins for the coin god. Dude, I just cannot hit a single of these fucking coins, bro. Hey. Fuck off. How are you not dead? There we go. Coins? Oh, I don't know. Whoa, dude, calm down. Okay. That would have been great to, yeah. I've just missed all those shots. Great. Oh. Wait, is it the gas tank that blows up on their back? Hang on, dude. That is the sickest thing I've seen in my entire life. Actually, fucking poggers. Mm -mm -mm. So if I can actually hit some things, that would be even better. By the way. Oh my god. <laughs> I missed. Right? You have no idea how hard I'm focusing on this shit, by the way. It's not even funny in the slightest. That's gonna hurt. Owie. Dude, fuck off. You know what? Get coined, dude. There you go. That's what I thought. Oh. oh, statue man is back. You know, we just fight him as a boss. Anyways. Oh god. Come stop nudging me around, man. What the fuck? Oh, oh incoming school ball to dance. Ah. Well, that was not very good. I mean, we got 14k points for that, I guess. Mm. Well, I mean, we beat corporal communism, so I guess that's that. I suppose. Great. That's lovely. We'd love to see that. Alright, well. I guess on that note, um, let's go back to the mission. Heart of the Sunrise. Next episode, I suppose, we'll continue on with all the new stuff I haven't seen yet. So, hope you guys have enjoyed the start of a new series. Next time we'll be back and we'll be continuing on with the next chapter, act. I don't know what you want to really call it. doesn't matter. Hope you guys have enjoyed. Until next time, do take care and I'll see you then. Bye!